welcome back to my YouTube channel. How exciting is that? It's been a while. I'm finally not sick. I really, really have been wanting to film a haul, AliExpress haul. I spent like $700 back in November. Um, but I just got like so sick. I got sick twice in a row and then this last one just lasted like seven weeks. So um, I really want to do that now and a couple people have been asking me um, time and time again. Um, you've probably already seen most of the clothing, but oh well, I still want to do it. And to be honest, this is probably going to be more of like a collective haul just because I'm constantly shopping. So I also have a couple other cute things from like Hot Topic and um, Amazon and just stuff like that. So I'll probably include that. So let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go through skirts first, or should I just say like bottoms in general? Um, starting with AliExpress. This one, I'm not the greatest fan of just because the material is like super flimsy, but it is pretty cute. It's a little large. I got a small, but honestly, you can just put it in the back. But yeah, I really liked it because of the little details, the ribbons, the little crisscross on the belt area. I really liked has a real functioning like zipper, which is always nice. And the length is pretty cute. And I like the, um, I guess it has shorts. Oh, is there pockets? Oh my God, there's pockets. There's real pockets, that's so crazy. I was not expecting that. Um, shorts, cool. This tool on the bottom is pretty cute too. I thought that was, one of the sewing points for me. But yeah, if it was like a little more fitting, like that, it'd be perfect. And if the material was a little less fake. <laughs> but, I don't know. I'd say, um, maybe like, Like a six out of ten, maybe. I was gonna say five, but I do like it. I just have to fit it a little better. Okay, this next one is not really my style, but I thought it was pretty cute. It's like this little pencil skirt with the lace and the little bow. Super soft, very thin, very super thin. Um, but it is like a cotton material, which is always nice. It's pretty stretchy. Um, fits pretty good. There's no like loose fabric or anything. Um, yeah, I don't know. I like this one quite a bit. I'd say like eight or nine out of ten. I like it a lot. <laughs> I've yet to wear it though because like I said, it's not really like necessarily my style, but I feel like it'd be a cute like going out to do errands or something. Cool. For the next one, I'm like scared to do the zipper. I don't wanna catch my skin. Man, this is like the worst thing about tennis skirts is that I love how fitted they are but it requires a side zip, and side zips are so scary. Oh my god, I'm scared. I don't want to commit. I'm scared. <laughs> oh my goodness. <gasps> Ow! Okay, that wasn't that bad. It did get me a little bit. Okay, here it is. Plain white tennis skirt, but it comes, I mean, I totally could have done this myself, but it comes with little bows, only in the front though. That's just normal. It has shorts. I don't necessarily love that, um, but it's useful, definitely. Um, so yeah, super soft. Uh, it's actually pretty good material. It's thick. Um, it's not hemmed. So I have a feeling that's not gonna go well the longer I own it. 
the shorts I feel like are pretty thick so you're not gonna really see much through this which is nice it's very fitted there's not a lot of loose fabric really at all I don't know I really like it I did get this exact skirt to go with an exact sweater um, since I'm kind of just like trying each and every single one on I will put up like the screenshots of like the kind of outfits I was going for with these I'm not gonna necessarily wear them right now just cuz I'm just going through each one quickly but yeah I've got this one specifically for a sweater I'd say this one's like a 10 out of 10 this one's so cute I haven't tried this on yet I got this skirt specifically to go with this top just because I thought the pinks were pretty similar and they're more muted but look at how cute this is I don't have my glasses on so I can't really see the viewfinder but let me see oh my god I love it I mean it's a little long longer than I usually do but the shape is so cute this is so girly I love it um, definitely would be a cute one for a belt I don't know what belt, but a belt. <laughs> um, the material's not that great. Uh, it's pretty thin, um, very flimsy, um, but somehow the shape like, is very well formed with this material. So, I don't know, give some, lose some. And then buttons, real buttons. Cool. There's a zipper, functioning, nice. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of the material, but for a rating, I'm gonna give this like a eight out of 10. I think it's so cute. Wow. I don't know, I just really like it. It's, I love the shape, it makes me feel pretty. On to the next. The next one, this one's super simple. It's stretchy. There's no zippers, no buttons. It's just, you pull it up, pull it down. There's shorts, pretty see-through though. Um, there's a couple layers here. Um, you got like the, ooh, there's a string. I don't like that. Um, so like the first layer is obviously just like this tool. Um, this next layer is like tool with lace at the bottom. And then there's this little lace layer at the top here, which I think is super cute. The length is nice. I will say it's not that see-through, but I would still wear like nude panties with this just because I don't know can't quite trust tool on tool but yeah I don't know it's okay I don't love it but I'd still give it like a seven or something seven out of ten this is so funny it's so big <laughs> this next skirt it's huge it's velvet brown it might not look brown on camera but it's so dark. I swear it's brown. It's like this deep chocolatey brown. It's so beautiful. Um, it's actual velvet, so the material is super thick. Very nice, plush. Um, it has like this nice cotton lace at the trim here. Uh, two layers with a stretchy band, no buttons, no zipper. Um, I got this specifically to go with my platform Uggs and these. Um, I got these leg warmers and I got these brown ones that match this as well. Um, so I don't know, I was really excited for this skirt. I haven't worn it out yet, but I really, <laughs> I was like super imaging wearing it to Barnes and Noble because I'm extra. I feel like it's a good library outfit with like a sweater or something. I don't know, 
Oh, it's just so pretty. It's so extra, I love it. The shape is like so voluminous. 10 out of 10, definitely. I love it a lot. Super nice material. Okay. Alrighty. This one, um, I got this in two colors. This is my favorite out of the two. Uh, the super cute, just like gray, plain gray, light gray, um, two layered skirt with some frills. Again, some cotton um, lace at the trim here. It has like an actual functional waistband. I just keep mine loose. Super stretchy, no buttons, no zipper, very comfortable. Um, the fit is pretty nice, the shape is decent. Um, super summery, I don't know. I just really like how the vibe of comfortable and cute this is. Um, the other color, I don't love. It's supposed to be black. It looks more black on camera, but it's definitely like a dark gray, like charcoal -y color. I really wanted it to be more of like a pitch black. Nine out of 10 for this one. I almost forgot. All right, here's the darker one. I don't want to say black because it's not black, but it says black like on AliExpress. I'd call this more like charcoal. Um, it looks better on camera than I think it looks in person, which sucks, but yeah, I like it on the camera. It's pretty cute. And they do have shorts, so to each their own. In real life, I'm giving it like a 5 out of 10. I don't really love it. Alright, this one I've worn quite a bit. I like this one a lot. Super simple. This one is black. This is like a true black color. It's super dark, very pretty. Um, the material is really nice. I don't know what it is, but it's pretty thick. And it forms really well with the ridges on the bottom here. Uh, has like a little peplum on the end here. Super pretty, it has like a little seam here. I don't know, I just really like it from farther away. I think the shape is really pretty, the length is super pretty, and it's super easy to wear with most tops. 10 out of 10, I love it. All right, I think this is the last skirt. Super pretty, very detailed. Um, you got a lot of line work, a lot of lace trim, got a couple really cute little tiny bows. Um, it doesn't really fit that well. Waist length. And I prefer um, not really trying to show this much of my belly on a daily basis. Um, but the length, like where it's at, is super cute. If it were like up here, it'd be even more cute. But it's okay. I don't know, I'm sure I can pin it or something. Um, the shape is super pretty. I love the details. There are shorts. Not really that see-through, but still with the white, definitely gonna wear um, some nude panties with that. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I'd give it maybe like seven out of, out of 10 just cause I got a small and it's not very small, so yeah. Next item is this cute little zip-up jacket. It, it's not that little, it's pretty oversized, but that's how I like it. I ordered it a little bigger. Super nice zipper, has pockets, and the best part, it's got ginormous bunny ears on the hood. Um, let me see. I wore this in uh, one of my previous YouTube videos. I don't know if I really showed off these <laughs> insane bunny ears. That's so funny, they're so long. I like it. Do you like it? Do you 
like it. <laughs> um, definitely a 10 out of 10. The material is really comfortable. It's not see-through at all. It's pretty thick, which is nice. Um, I love the bunny ears. Not necessarily the most like efficient jacket ever, but I, I'm not really the person to kind of care about that, so that's good. 10 out of 10. I like it a lot. Okay, now with the AliExpress purchases, I really wanted to get some sweaters, um, like cute ones that match more of my aesthetic. Um, so I was really only able to find, I think it was like four sweaters, really. Um, this is one of them. I think it's pretty cute, oversized, which is nice. Only barely though on my arms, which I don't necessarily love, but it's okay. Um, fit is nice. There's this little detail on the back with um, this, black ribbon. I think it's pretty cute. Yeah, I don't know. The length is nice. The material is okay. It's soft. It's kind of like that scuba-y material though. Um, not see-through. So points for that. Um, I'd rate it like a 7 out of 10. Just because it's not like the most comfortable thing because I just feel like I'm long unfortunately. Okay, this next one is so cute. I love it so much. Super comfortable. Green has little bunnies on it. Says uh, a happy day and best wishes on it. Super random, but um, very cute. Has this little trim at the bottom. And then on the sleeves we have some little dots and some flowers. Super cute. Um, Material is very soft. Not really that see-through. Very comfortable. I like how it feels. It's not itchy. It's relatively warm. Um, yeah, I've worn it a lot, so 10 out of 10. Next sweater. Super cute. This is like the preppiest like top I own. I don't own v-necks. It's so odd. Um, it makes me feel like I'm stepping out of my comfort zone a little bit, but um, super cute though. I really enjoy the shape of the sweater. It's very fitting, even for my long arms, which is nice. Um, I got two bunnies again in the heart. It says, please find a love from the Chabot. I'm assuming these are Chabots. Got a bunch of upside down hearts, right side up hearts, all over, except for the back, I guess. Oh, they're on the back, okay. I don't know, I don't know what the backs look like. I guess I would, because they're on my hangers, but <laughs> I don't really pay attention that much. But yeah, the fit, super cute. Material is so soft, very thick. Like, super soft, not itchy at all. I love it. 10 out of 10. Last sweater, unfortunately, but I saved my favorite for last. Um, I love this. This is my favorite sweater. I've worn this, like, once a week since I've gotten it. <laughs> it is so cute. Um, it's just, like, this cream color. Very nice details in the stitching. Um, it's got this super cute little flower heart and a little ribbon at the bottom with a teddy bear in the middle. Perfect. I don't know who came up with that, but amazing job. Um, the length, super cozy. It's even long on my arms, which is so nice. It is so cozy, so soft. It's not necessarily the thickest, but if you like, if it's cold outside, just throw an undershirt on and you're perfect. My favorite sweater, 100 out of 20, uh, 100 out of 10. I've been wearing it so much, I'm surprised it's not like ugly by now.
Okay, moving on from sweaters. Um, I have this super cute, I have like so many shirts that look like this just without the bows. I don't know why I feel like I need to buy the bows, buy the, the same shirt with the bows instead of just adding bows, but um, I'm crazy. But yeah, instead of buttons like a shirt normally would have, uh, there's these super cute little pink bows. <laughs> need I explain more? No, I don't. Um, yeah, it's pretty cute. Um, materials, really nice. It is a little see-through, um, but these shirts typically are. Um, it has like this little detail print. There's little pearls in the bows. It's very soft, it fits my long arms. <laughs> I feel like that's gotta be like for a tall person. I'm not really even that tall. I'm like five, 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 six. But I just have really long arms. So for a person with long arms, having a shirt, long sleeve shirt that actually fits them is like it makes like the world of a difference. Um so much more cozy with the fact that it fits. The material is very soft. Um so yeah, 10 out of 10 for this one too. Okay, um, next one, it's, I've gotten this in two colors, the white and black. It's a cardigan, I think, uh, like a little jacket. Um, it's okay, it's not my favorite. Um, firstly, because of how short the sleeves are, unfortunate. Um, this would be super cute if it fit the length of my arms a little better. Um, but otherwise, it's pretty cute. I feel like a little tight. That looks better. Um, yeah, it's got this super cute lace trim around um, the sleeves and the bottom of the trim of the shirt. Um, very cute. The fabric itself is a little itchy, not gonna lie. Um, I'd probably feel better wearing something underneath this and not just a bra. Um, I'd say it's probably a little see-through. Um, so, yeah, probably better to go on top of something or just nothing at all. I really like the trim. The trim is super cute. Very itchy though, like extremely, like I'm starting to itch wearing it right now. Um, I just wish it would fit! Otherwise it'd be like a 9 out of 10, but I'm gonna have to rate it like a 5 out of 10. I don't know. I just can't really see myself wearing this too much might have to donate it just because I don't it just makes me feel so uncomfortable I feel exposed I mean I am exposed but like I don't know five out of ten and here's the black same exact thing same length same material same like trim super cute it just doesn't fit that well unfortunately but I don't know. I feel like I like the black better, to be honest. So I might give this one more of like a six out of ten. Um, still itchy, but six out of ten. I don't know. <laughs> this next one, I love. Technically, it would be more like a jacket, but definitely can wear it like a shirt. Um, just black and gray stripes. Uh, long sleeve fits fantastically it's so snug and so comfortable I love it like 50 out of 10 basically um, there is a hood let me see I've never worn it but I mean it's not very useful but there's a hood so that's cool um, but yeah I love it one of my favorite purchases this next one Super baby girl. I like it a lot. Um, reminds me so much of like the stuff that I had in my childhood with these little fabric roses. So cute. I love that. Very see-through. You can see right through it. Um, I'm wearing like a nude bra right now so maybe it's not as obvious but yeah. You definitely either have to wear a bra you want people to see or 
I don't know, wear like an undershirt, which really sucks though, because I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be off the shoulder. So like, I don't know, I guess maybe you can do like the baby sleeves. Yeah, but that's gonna be like really annoying after a while. Um, very soft, very stretchy. Um, I really like the design of the actual fabric itself. Um, yeah, I don't know. I like it a lot. I'm gonna give it like an 8 out of 10. These next two shirts I am in love with. This one, maybe a little less than the next one, just because this material is literally like bathing suit material like that scuba material. It's printed on. Um, it's not that stretchy. Um, however, it's not itchy and it's very comfortable. Like I can wear this all day at work and be very comfortable, which I've done. Um, super cute. I love the freaking gingham. Um, like the sideways gingham, very odd. I've never really seen sideways super cute it's like straight on the side and then on the front it's like sideways um love the details the lace here is super cute how it just kind of panels out the different um checker patterns and then of course you gotta have a little bow um the cut line is super cute too i don't know if that's sweetheart but it definitely accentuates the boobs um, back of it, it's pretty simple, there's not much going on, but yeah, I don't know, I'm still giving this a 10 out of 10 because I'm in love with it. I love this one! This shirt is like everything I wish I could have had when I was like 13. It is so cute. It's got the little peplum um, trim here super soft material it's like I don't know if it's cotton but it feels like cotton very stretchy very soft not itchy at all um, there's a fake like zipper detail or not zipper but like a button detail super cute well placed buttons um, and then there's this like fake undershirt here just polka dot like I have not seen polka dots since like 2008. It's so cute, I love it so much. And then you got the little bow, of course. And then we have more like peplum details here. Back of it, super simple. Um, but yeah, no, I'm in love. 1,000 out of 10. I wear this like once a week. <laughs> okay, I think this is one of the last ones. I think second to last. Um, super cute, um, dusty pink, it's not really like a baby pink, it's more of like dusty, muted pink. Um, super cute, fits my arms, points. Um, the lace here, very cute, um, and then there's this like detail where it kind of makes it look like a halter. I've never had a shirt that looks like this, but... I think that's very um, professional looking. I don't know, is that dumb? I don't know, that's what I thought when I saw it on AliExpress. Um, but yeah, odd detail, still cute. I love the ribbon. Um, the length is perfect. It is a little see-through, so I usually wear this one with an undershirt. Um, super easy fix. But yeah, still, I'd probably give it like an eight out of 10. Okay, I think this is the last shirt from AliExpress. Um, this one definitely gave me some like early 2000 vibes um, with the little, again, the fabric rose, the little bow at the center here, the trim, super cute. Um, however, that's basically it though. It's super simple, very soft material, pretty see-through. So. Definitely an undershirt kind of top, um, but like I said, easy fix for that. Um, the length is nice, fits really nicely, simple in the back. I'm gonna give this one an eight out of 10 as well. I like it, cute. This is the first 
jacket I've ever bought from AliExpress. And it is one of my favorite items I've ever bought from AliExpress and I've been buying there since I was 18, I think. Um, but yeah, it's like this leather, pleather, it's not real leather, um, black, regular zip up. It's got two um, ports where you can kind of make it fit however you'd like, which I appreciate. Um, the details on the front are so cute. Um, you got these like white stripes all throughout on the arms, on the chest. And then you got these so, these like adorable bows. They're so precious. I love them so much on both sides. And then you just got like, on the arms, it's so cute. It fits so well too. Like it fits my arms so well. Got a little zip on the cuff. I don't know, it's just like, one of my favorite jackets now. It's so, like, I've never seen anything like it, so. And everyone always goes crazy when I wear it. So, success. <laughs> um, a thousand out of ten, can I say? Okay, um, so now that the AliExpress portion is, for the most part, done, I do have a couple other things from a couple other places. Um, I'm gonna start with Aritziak. I've never been there um, until last year. Um, super cute store. They have like really nice basic pieces. Um, both of these are from there. This top I'm in love with. It's so fitting. Super cute. I can like stretch the sleeves out, which is always my favorite. Um, it is not. Like, the material is pretty thick. It's not as see-through as you think it would be. Um, but the bottom part is, like, literally see-through. There's, like, holes. So, I don't know. If you're, like, the kind of person who enjoys having see-through, like, pieces, 10 out of 10. Um, the bottoms, uh, I think these are so cute. Um, super casual easy to wear to work, um, easy to wear literally anywhere. Um, these with like some heels or like some wedges or something I think would be a great fit. Um, top is a 10 out of 10. Bottoms I'm gonna give them like an 8 out of 10 just because they're not really my style necessarily but for work they're amazing. This next one I don't own anything this color, so it's kind of crazy, but I have like this hot pink silk, like pencil skirt, long pencil skirt. It is so pretty. I love the material. I think the materials really just got me like what was, no, I think the material is really what got me to want to buy it is it's so pretty. It's like iridescent kind of. I don't know, you gotta like really look at it. The sheen is just beautiful. It's like purple and like white and pink. It's so pretty. I wouldn't really necessarily wear it with this top, but it's just what I had on. Um, but yeah, I have not worn it out yet. So I've yet to do that just cause like, I don't, I don't know where I would wear this to like a beach somewhere um definitely more of like a summertime springtime kind of vibe uh but so beautiful definitely a 10 out of 10 and i got in a lighter pink too so i'll put that on now this one is definitely a little bit more my vibe it's like more of like a pastel pink um very neutral almost blend in with my wall <laughs> I blend in with my wall. That's so funny. Same exact skirt, just a different color. It is a little wrinkled, so I do apologize, but the color is just gorgeous. It's so pretty. I wanna wear it to like a lunch date or something. I feel like that'd be so elegant with like little, little heels or something. So cute, 10 out of 10. Hey, next, 
This one is definitely a little out of my comfort zone, but it is so hot. I don't know what it is about pencil skirts, but they are so like fitting. I love the material. Aritzia just like knows, I don't know, their materials are phenomenal. Like it fits perfectly. I'm in love with it. Have not worn it. I don't know where to wear something like this, but if I ever have like a meeting or anything that allows this length of skirt, it's there. I'm wearing it. But yeah, I love it. Super simple. Like a pleather material, it's not stretchy at all, so you really have to like be able to fit in it. Um, but yeah, 10 out of 10. I love Aritzia. I need to go there more often. Last pencil skirt, I swear. Um, this one's basically just like the last one. Material is different. It's more of like a, a fabric, like cotton fabric material. A little stretchier. Um, so it kind of makes it a little more comfortable. Like I can eat in this one. <laughs> um, but it's still super fitting. Um, yeah, I don't know. Same thing. I have Santiago's hair on there. Um, but yeah, I have no idea where I would wear this, but I had to have it. It's so cute. Just in case, you never know. How many lunch dates am I planning on having? Or like business casual attire jobs? Like, you never know. Okay, this is the black version of the white shirt I just had on. Same exact thing. Still love it, it's perfect, 10 out of 10. Um, I am gonna wear this underneath one of the dresses that I got from Aritzia. Um, this one I wore to the beach, it's so cute. It reminds me of uh, Hachiko from Nana, um, one of the dresses she wore to art school. Um, I don't know, I think I might like cosplay her one of these days. That exact outfit, it's my favorite outfit. Um, but yeah, like this with black knee-high socks and those white sandals. It looks just like it, kind of. Um, but yeah, very baby doll fit. Um, super high um, cut line here. Um, but I like it because how much material is on the bottom. Super cute, like bathing suit dress in my opinion. Um, I don't really know. I'd really wear this without something underneath just because the fit is a little awkward um, if it's just nothing because then I just feel like you're swimming in it. You might see this um, featured in a Hachiko cosplay. Uh, we'll see how that goes. Might have to buy some more things from AliExpress to make that a reality. Um, but yeah, 10 out of 10 for this dress. This one I feel so pretty in. I want to go on a date. I have so many date clothes, but like I've, I don't ever wear this stuff because like, I don't know, it's not like casual enough to really like wear it out on a daily basis. I guess maybe you could make it like that, but I don't know. I want to go on a date and wear this. I think it's so pretty. It fits me really well. Aritzia, like, I don't know, the materials and the fit are just always a 10 out of 10. Like, just look at that. It like hugs my body. Super cute. Just need an excuse to wear it. <laughs> Definitely a 10 out of 10. I don't think there's any other vote that would do this justice. This one too. Oh my gosh. I mean, this is definitely more of like a going on at night dress, kind of like the opposite of what I just had on, but it's so perfect. It's so like contouring, it's so pretty. The actual material's like super thick. It's ribbed the entire way around. Um, I love the square cut that's so pretty without the bra. I don't know. Someone needs to take me out. <laughs> I like it a lot. It's so cute. Definitely a 10 out of 10. I just have nowhere to wear these things. I'm gonna go crazy. 
I lied. There was one more top from Aritzia, but it's literally like this corset. Oh my God, it's gonna come off. Um, it's like this corset top, but I don't know if I can get it on by myself because it is like really tight. Oh my God, I did it. Bless you, bless you. Oh my gosh. Ugh. There's like ribbing and everything in this. Holy macaroni. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> I didn't think I was gonna get it zipped. Oh my gosh. Now this thing is not for the weak. I don't even know if my boobs will fit in this with my bra on. It's gonna have to anyway. Whew. This is, I don't know. Like, I've worn this top before. Oh my gosh. I've worn this top multiple times before. And honestly, I think it is my favorite thing that I've bought from Aritzia. And I bought a lot of stuff. Um, it is just incredible. The boning is perfect. It creates like the most incredible waist like ever. It's so pretty. And um, next, I'm gonna probably show a couple things from Amazon, but for this top, I really enjoy wearing it with this skirt that I got from Amazon, just cause look how cute this is. It is so pretty! I wanna cry, it's so perfect. <sighs> but yeah, without the bra, a million out of ten. I love this top. It's my favorite. It makes me feel so pretty. Uh, skirt. I love this skirt too. It's definitely a little loose. Like, there's some extra space. But with a top like this, it kind of just sits perfectly. Um, skirt's like a, I don't know, seven out of ten. Before I change out of this top, I did want to show off this skirt. It's a micro skirt that I got from Amazon. Um, super cute. I don't know how much of that I can show. I'm not going to turn around. Um, but yeah, it's just super. I mean, obviously, you're not wearing this really anywhere outside. So it's really just for inside. But yeah, the material's decent. The ruffles are my favorite. Super cute. Very micro. 8 out of 10. I like it. Okay, this next top is from Amazon. I kept the skirt on just because. Why not? Um, halter see-through with rhinestones. How cute is that? And the back is open. Obviously, I'd wear it without the bra. Um, but yeah, I wanted to wear this. Specifically, I got this from Amazon too. But I didn't know the sleeves were going to be this long. It's crazy. It's kind of like a shrug, but except it's like an actual shirt. But the sleeves are so long. I wanted to go to a rave and wear something like this, um, but <laughs> I think that's so funny. Like how would I wear this like outside? I'd have to like <laughs> do this every time I need to grab something. Um, but yeah, no, I think it's super cute. Um, I like it with the halter top. I think that's cute too. Um, but yeah, it's just the sleeves are a little crazy. <laughs> Still though, I would rate this like an 8 out of 10 because it is comfy, super soft. I love like the shape. It is odd. But I think that's what makes it so cute. Yeah, Amazon fit. <laughs> From Hot Topic, drum roll. Um, I found this shirt, like design type, on Hot Topic's website. And I fell in love with it. 
I don't usually wear green, but like it is so cute and I got it the exact same shirt in pink. Um, I'd say the fit is decent. The material is incredible, but I've been wearing it like tied up in the back just because I think it does make it look a little nicer or it fits my aesthetic a little bit more. Um, so basically I just get a hair tie and I just bump, I like bundle up all the excess fabric and it just fits me like, like a glove. Um, but yeah, I love this color. So unusual. I don't usually like green, um, but it's growing on me. I got this bucket hat as well from Hot Topic. <laughs> it's so cute. It's got like blue floral on the inside. I feel like I'm ready for springtime. Maybe not with the micro mini skirt, but a girl can dream. <laughs> oh, top 10 out of 10. Hat 10 out of 10. I love green now. I'm a green person. Here's the pink version. <laughs> it's so cute. I love this top so much. I'm like so excited I found out that it exists and it comes in white too so I might even get that one but the best part of this Hot Topic haul I wasn't even planning on like buying jeans I've never bought jeans from Hot Topic before but these are the coolest jeans I own like so cool they remind me of Jenko's, but Jenko's are like $200 and these were $40. Um, so yeah, let me show you. <laughs> Hopefully you can see all of it. Um, yeah, these are the best jeans ever. The pockets, amazing. The material is actual jeans. And the butt pockets, dude, they're hard. They're so cute. And it came with this chain pearl and then a silver um, link chain. Um, so cute. And then uh, there's this detail at the bottom. They're split. Um, but there's a whole ribbon. So cool. Definitely have to wear these with platform boots. But I just, I cannot believe I got these from Hot Topic. It's crazy and it matches my shirt like perfectly Like with the pink Um, one million out of ten okay. It's definitely hard to follow that up with those jeans, but this skirt from Hot Topic is pretty cute um, Doesn't fit that great But if I wear it with a belt, it'd be pretty Perfect. Um, has these super cute little heart buttons. There's two of them. I didn't do this one all the way. There it goes. Um, and then it has like a functioning zipper. Um, let's see. Pockets are real. Super nice. Didn't even know that. And then um, we have these heart lace details on the trim here. And there's two tiers. Um, but yeah, pretty cute. I wish it fit a little bit better, um, but I'd still say I like it a lot. Um, I'd give this one probably like an 8 out of 10. And look at pink anything just works. So, yeah. <laughs> now I have to put all this stuff back away. Santiago's exhausted. <laughs> And my hair is crazy. But yeah, that was my long awaited, um, basically AliExpress haul, um, but it was more of like a collective haul towards the end there. Um, thank you so much for watching, and I'm sorry if clothes don't really excite you, but they excite me a lot, and I do a lot of shopping. And a lot of people usually ask me where my stuff is from. Um, so yeah, in the last like four months, yeah, that's a lot of the stuff that I've bought in that time span. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!